The next massive thing for Season 1 is going to be coming in Season 1 Reloaded, so it's not going to be there on release, as Season 1 Reloaded is going to begin on December 14th. What this means is that Season 1 will probably last two months, considering Reloaded is exactly a month after it begins. Anyway, Season 1 Reloaded is going to be introducing raids, which are three-player missions with complex puzzles to solve, so they might be akin to Zombies Easter Eggs, but probably not as complex. This is going to be a mode within Spec Ops, and Season Season 1 Reloaded will see the very first episode of Raids for Operators to Master. Infinity War did also release this statement regarding Raids on Twitter, saying following the events of the Modern Warfare 2 campaign, each seasonal phase will advance our ongoing story, as old friends and new enemies tie up loose ends. So they seem to be alluding that Raids is probably going to be to do with Shepard and Shadow Company, judging from this statement of tying up loose ends and old friends and new enemies. But yeah, this is going to be telling the post-campaign storyline following on from the campaign. Right now we're getting one raid in season one, and I wonder if we're going to be getting one raid per season, each one tied to the seasonal cinematic. It's possible that the campaign post credit scene on a plane is sabotaged by Russian ultranationalists, the reboot of No Russian with Makarov could be for a raid two, unless this is just a teaser for the rumored campaign DLC in year two, or potentially even Modern Warfare 3. But what do you think of No Russian potentially being a raid instead of a campaign mission this time? Or would you rather that be saved for a campaign mission? Spec Ops unfortunately has only received three missions at launch, all played on the Almazra map too, so I'm hoping we will get more in Season 1, but the only Spec Ops content Infinity Ward's confirmed for Season 1 thus far is the first raid in Season 1 Reloaded. Spec Ops is pretty decent, I actually like Spec Ops this year, I thought Modern Warfare 2019 Spec Ops was really underwhelming. The issue with Spec Ops in Modern Warfare 2 though is there's barely any content, and once again this comes back to what I was saying earlier about how it seems like all of the developers are just putting all of their attention into DMZ and Warzone, considering Spec Ops is literally just played on the Warzone map anyways, and even 6v6 multiplayer, a lot of it is just played on Almazra, so basically Warzone is the building blocks for all the other modes in the game now. They work on Warzone first, and then find a way to reuse Warzone content for the other aspects of the game. I would love to see survival mode come to Spec Ops, because we already have a mission that is basically survival, but you can only play for 6 waves, Considering they have all of the groundwork for the mode in the game, I hope we get a fully fledged survival mode, but right now we have no word on it just yet.